What's going on, everybody? How is everybody doing? So it's good to see uh, a lot of uh, familiar faces as well tonight, and uh, a couple there notice noticeables as well. So first off, so let me thank everybody here for a uh, special. If you look on the main page, there is a special new five-digit number that is under my name somehow. I'm not sure exactly where that came from. Maybe I don't know some viewers here in chat here tonight. So. Uh, possibly, I don't know, maybe some of you guys here in, in stream have, have been a part of this. I I, I don't know, may, maybe just something around up there. <laughs> yeah, there you go, man. So, yeah, so we are just hit 10,000 subscribers, and I'm literally beaming uh, from, I, was, I would say face-to-face, -face, but I'm literally beaming from ear to ear. Uh, that's a, it's a big milestone for me, so quick. <laughs> So Greybug is, is is using one of our new sponsor remotes here, uh, especially made by our Mick, uh, Mr. Nick T. Um, he is responsible for that. So that's my caricature with my hat, the full beard, and everything. So, uh, yeah, so I'll have to get the bigger picture. I have to tweet that, man. I, I totally forgot, Nick. So I apologize for that. So there you go. So there's a couple there. We're going to do another one for I – don't, I, I, don't I don't have the source here on uh, – I don't have the source on my OBS, man, or Streamlabs, man. I, I totally, uh, I totally missed that, man. I, I will have to do it. Um, we'll have to do it again, like tomorrow. We'll set it up, and I'll have it like as the inset box, man. I, I just, yeah, I just totally forgot that one. So there you there, Mac Two X. So thank you, there, buddy. Appreciate that. Um, so there's a ton of new people that came in here, especially over this this past day. We had almost 100 subs between last night and just this today, obviously, because we just hit 9,900 last night, and then here we are at 10K. I was hoping we'd hit 10K 
uh, in the stream, but that's okay. So um, no, no problems there. So especially there, uh, Mr. Call of Duty 2662, big shout out to you as well for coming in uh, and subscribing as well. So thanks guys, appreciate the, the congrats on 10K. It's, uh, I know it's, it's I'm, I'm happy, but I have to say that I do, uh, I, I do a lot of this stuff and, and you guys come and you like the videos, you subscribe, you wanna see more content, you're interactive in chat. Um, so the, you know, the thing that's really cool about this, is the last thing I'll say, the really, the thing that I enjoy most of being able to do the live streams, um, if I was doing videos, it would still be fun, but not nearly as fun. Cause there's a lot more interaction. I'm actually getting to know subscribers here in the channel and I've gotten to meet people through the live stream that I probably wouldn't have, uh, gotten to meet had it been through something else. So we got a couple of uh, specials in here as well. I got all of my subs in here as well and some new uh well some some new but also we've got new sponsors in uh and some old time sponsors so you guys will know especially incline he's a he's another twitch and a buddy of mine a uh, big supporter here at the channel and i like him and like his stuff as well he's a really good guy and he's uh doing some streaming there on twitch as well i think he does, i don't know if you do any more on on incline if you do any more on youtube but i know he's pretty much put all these eggs there in twitch so he's good does what he does Said my name. Ah, shoot, man. Uh, I, I I always shout out the people there, the big supporters of the channel, man. So, um, so I appreciate it, man. Uh, as well as we got Mr. Nick T in the house, and you'll notice that all these guys have little chevrons and stuff. So one chevron is um, is one month subscriptions, and then two month subscriptions for the twos, and then the threes. Well, actually, the two the two bars go from two months to five months, uh, and then six months is the three chevrons, and we haven't had anyone do it a year yet just because we haven't done it so thank you there kid appreciate it uh, awesomeness what's up man how are you hope you're doing well and mr chance rasmussen good to see you guys as well so okay so here's what we'll listen we've got the pleasantries out uh now chat just hang on a minute here uh and i will uh we'll certainly catch up with you here just give me a, a couple of minutes here to set up always so as you can see we're in the freightliner fld 120 i was planning on doing the t800 today um but for whatever reason i started running into problems with the back end of the the cable uh, was was catching on all of my flatbeds that I had. It, the corner of it was catching on every single one of them. I don't know what the problem was. Um, so anyway, I've got all of my stuff, and then I tried on this one. Does not have that cable stand right there by the the back, um, you know, where the trailer attachment is. So or where the fifth wheel is. So hopefully uh, we're good to go now. I did some testing, and I think everything's good. So uh, I decided I would run with this one. This is a 1.31 truck, although a few of the trailers that we're using today are not 1.31. So we won't see the, the trailer cable animations, but everything else is in order as well. And secondly, uh, we are in the brand new, this is part two of our Viva Mexico trip. So uh, we've, I've always stay in Mexico some because everyone's always in the States and they're not. So let me show you kind of what we got mapping wise, especially if you're just, just joining in um, and you're kind of, kind of catching up on what we're doing. This is part two. We did a first part of it yesterday. So as you can see, it adds all of this stuff right here was all in the, you know, two point whatever. I mean, this became just a build upon. So every couple of months, new, new versions come out, they update the mod. Uh, the last one, the big update they had was Durango, which added a lot of this area right here. Well, now, uh, they've added this whole, uh, I don't even know how to say it. They've added this whole entire province down here on the bottom or a state. I'm not sure if Mexico does states or does provinces. But anyway, uh, this whole entire bottom half here was been added in brand new. So yesterday, I basically cut the middle uh, of the loaf all the way down through Fresnillo. Uh, the we came all the way down there to Pinos or Pinos. Uh, thank you there, Patrick. Appreciate that subscription. As always, man. Uh, so we had that right there all the way down to Pinos. Now we're, we're kind of back up at least uh, into uh, Zacatecas or Zacatecas. Zacatecas. Tecas. Or so, oh, yeah, whatever. So we're here and we're going we're gonna to be moving our way back down to uh, Yapa. So now yeah, we'll see how things go. So I'm going to do this and then we're going to try to cut through some of these middle cities that we can because there's some really, really, really cool places uh, in and around some really cool roads that we're going to be able to travel on. So that's going to be able to knock Day. And thank you, Mr. Andrew Castaneda. Good to see you, man. Hurst dog, what's up? Oh, what nice. Yeah, you didn't tell me, man. You didn't tell me. Well, congrats there. Uh, do the lift truck. Oh, well, I would. I've already got my load that's going to exactly where we want to go. So, uh, yes, so we're already in progress here. Let's go ahead and let's let's get it up. Get it. Um, I don't have it. Well, it depends on which flatbed you use, Josh. I think that's part of my problem. Um, I didn't have enough time to really do a bunch of comparisons, but I think that's probably the problem. I also put in a new realistic graphics mod. I'm not graphics mod, but the realistic physics mod. And it's possible that that was, that I was messing with it, man. Um, I'm not exactly sure. So 
so anyway so here we are uh, so we're in this uh, we're in this nice area here this is a pretty busy sector um, pretty busy sector so here is uh, let me let me hide this at least there well thank you there's Steven Ecker coming in with a subscription there joining FCG tonight appreciate it there buddy appreciate that so here's the in interior here of our FLD freight shaker uh, and it sounds absolutely awesome um, so we'll be riding this tonight, and we've got uh, a set of tubes on uh, just one big huge. I'm not sure if this will be like a drainage uh, or if this is like industrial for something else. So it's about 60,000 pounds, uh, and we're going to Yapa, which uh, let me just, let me zoom in on the map here. So I'll show you what I mean by the roads. So you can see as we get down here, see like coming out of Yapa down here. So once we make our delivery, I want to see if we can't come up through this this other one back up into this one. So we're going to see some really cool roads in here. Um, and just to kind of give you an idea, like look at this one all the way down to, uh, to Hazamoda, uh, all of this crazy stuff through here. So, I mean, there's some really, really slick stuff in here. A lot of really nice extreme roads, all of this stuff down here, just cutbacks through all these low cities and little, little towns and little, little, just little, you know, mom and pop places down here on the side. It's just really cool. So, so anyway, so, uh, let me catch up here on Zoe. Kirk, what's up, man? Welcome to all our new people there. Uh, don't know why you did their kid diesel, but you don't have to ask for shout outs, man. Just, just be here and hang out, ask questions, dude. You don't have to ask for shout outs. I mean, we never give shout outs just with people that ask them, but just, just be here, man, and plug in, uh, be a part of the conversation, man. You'll, you'll literally get all the shout outs you can take for a night. So, so let's go ahead and let's get her uh, started. I got a GPS. Actually, oh, you can't see it. In the top, uh, top left of your screen there. Well, thank you there. Is that Guillermina Ramirez? Appreciate that. Whoops. This truck's moving. Well, seriously? I am not a truck driver. I don't really claim or wish to be. <laughs> oh, nice, Josh. That'll be cool, man. I'm looking forward to seeing what these guys do, man. Let's go ahead and see if we can go ahead and cut the bug there. GMC, sorry, you got Viva today, and it's awesome. Absolutely, man. I love it. This is one of the best uh, map mods I've seen in quite some time. Trix, thank you there. Trixie or Trix. Thank you, man. Appreciate the subscription as always, bud. <laughs> uh, yeah, I love FTG with the Wendy symbol. I like it. I will settle for that because I do like me some Wendy's. Let's see there, Pop Zilla. Uh Yeah, so basically we've got a couple pieces of commercial real estate. Um, and then I do some woodworking on the side and I used to work in uh, church for a side. I used to do uh, used to do some stuff there with uh, worship lead and that kind of thing. So YouTube's kind of uh, kind of my side. Uh, so yeah, so we'll see how things go with it. 10,000 is, nice, uh, is a nice roll to it. So uh, no, I never did finish Hellblade, man. I never did never did it just I, I just ran out of time man and i had other stuff i wanted to do and it wasn't really great doing that great for the uh with the channel and stuff so i just elected uh you know elected to back up and put with something else yeah it does <laughs> it does sound good josh you're right man ryan braun what's up man how are you all right let's see wait a minute i uh That's going to the right. Okay, we gotta go this way. <laughs> now the interchanges in this uh, this map mod, if you've never been in this one, they're they're crazy.
<laughs> we just we just jacked someone's jaws while going across this speed bump. I love how uh, everybody actually slows down for it too. It's like it's totally legit, man. I did get 24 hours. I know, man. I know, dude. I know. Hey, what's up there, Adrian? How are you, man? <laughs> Be a great driver, maybe. There it is, Mario Gracia. Gracia. Sorry, not Gracia. <laughs> He's like, what? I don't know. I'm saying thank you. Thank you there, Mario. Appreciate it, man. I'll take that back. Oh, they just got shouted out, so thank you. Oh, yeah, but no problem. Well, I always take stabs at names. I might not get them right, so you guys are always free to uh, to let me know. Hey, you kind of screwed that up, man. You might want to try that again. <laughs> but like, okay. Quite okay. And thank you there, Skeet Stokes. Thank you there for your subscription, man. Appreciate it. Went to the stream Rotato Chip. Went to the stream Rotato Chip. I've already shouted you out, Ryan. <laughs> yeah. You guys don't have the thanks for the shout-outs, man. You just, just be here in conversation, man. Uh, the good thing about... Uh, the good thing about having a game like ATS or... ETS or any of those other games is it uh, it offers me a chance to be able to kind of plug in with you guys here in live stream kind of get to know who you are and be a little bit more personable than say uh, you're doing some of the other stuff that kind of doesn't leave you you know to be very interactive with chat so I always try to make everyone as long as your, your question is um, sometimes I miss stuff I mean I do um, I, I do always miss stuff and it, it's quite okay as long as it's not a, a stupid redundant question you feel free to ask it again as well as if you ask something serious, you know, like, hey, how did you get something, something, or where did you find this? If I miss it, doesn't mean necessarily that I'm ignoring you. So, yeah, no problem, Steve. Is it Steven or Stefan? I thought about that. Type in two for Stefan or one for Steven. I thought about that after I looked at it, and I was like, man, that might be Stefan. <laughs> I was like, I better ask that before I keep calling him Steven. And he's like, oh, it's, ah, it is Stefan. <laughs> I thought about it, and I was like, ah, I bet that's what it is. Okay, all right. Cool deal there, Stefan. Skippy plays AVMS well. It's easy way to make money without mods. <laughs> I mean, drive? That's not a really a smart answer. That's just the only way you can make money in here. Um, if you want to play the, the game legit, though, um, yeah, if, if you play it legit, you can always do it like a trucking company. So you actually hire drivers, and those drivers take routes. So it's not just about you making all the money for the company. You can make this a truck manager if you want to. Um, that's a totally legit way to do it. And thank you there, CJ. Is that Northwest? Thank you there, CJ. Appreciate it, man. I tell you, I, I don't know. I don't personally, obviously, live in Mexico. I'm curious if they put all of these uh, speed bumps going down all the hills in uh, Mexico. I'm assuming they do or they wouldn't be here. But, Lord, man, this is... <laughs> Oh, it sucks. <laughs> Thank you there, Johnny. Yeah, we can do more heavy haul. I'm actually planning on doing a little bit more. Um, doing a few, doing a little bit here and there uh, with some other stuff and some new mods, also some new videos. I'm also doing a few, um, uh, also doing a few with just like, in here I told you yesterday in live stream too, I, I didn't get all the way finished with it today. I got about, I don't know, three fourths of the way through. There's some really, really cool roads I'm gonna save a new video zone just because they're not really long. They'd be perfect for like a, a nice short vid on something. So be looking for that. You know, I, I really wanted to have some of that stuff up today, but I just never made it. Real life called, said, hey, we've been waiting for a while. Would you come over and tend to us? We'd like a shout out, please. I was like, okay, real world, we'll give you a shout out. And for all the uh, the horn freaks out there, got the official FTG train horn installed today, so it's going very nicely. Uh, G600, there is a 610, I think that's, uh, Josh is our resident ATS guy. Is that, is that T610, is that on the, is that on the Peterbilt side or is that on the Kenworth side? It's the new one though, I do know that. But I can't remember. You know what? I don't know, man. It's something that YouTube has uh, has started doing. It's not always been that way. It's getting on my nerves. Everyone that donates something, they take a cent. I'm like, you're already taking 30% of that super chat. 
you know? It's like, come on, man. Alright, let's, let's punch and get it going here. Yes, uh, it is Skippy. So, the, if I'm not mistaken, the FLD is on the Steam Workshop. Um, the FLB, which is the cab over version, it's on the Steam Workshop as well. So, uh, there's quite a, quite a bit of the stuff I'm doing now does feature stuff that is off of the uh, Steam Workshop. Uh, I do play Fernbus, uh, Popzilla, although I put a couple of videos up, but they did okay. Um, I just don't have very much of, I just don't have a, an American, I mean, I don't have a, a European audience that's uh, craving, um, you know, that's craving a European, I don't know, it's craving a European uh, coach game. Alright, so we're getting some good roads here, so you guys will get, uh, should get a, quite an, uh, an, an eyeful going through this, so... Let me see what we got here on this camera view. There you go. So you kind of you kind of see what I'm looking at here. One of these days I'm gonna get the shifter down on the ground to where it's uh, a little more, a little better. Uh, no, I'm probably not gonna do the crew. Honestly, I don't know. I'll have to think about it. I do have to be somewhat selective with the the mods that I do. I hope nobody comes around this turn. If not, they're going to be S O L. Ah, well, well, thanks there, Bob. Appreciate it, man. Appreciate it, man. It's a nice compliment. Nice there, Farm Sim Kings. How are you there, Farm Sim Kings? Good to see you, man. Uh, oh, what happened to multiplayer? Well, they started dropping. Um, you know, we, we had really good. We had 12, then we had 10, then we had 8, then we had 6, then we had 4. And I think that very last one, we might have had 2. We might have had 3 or 4 in it. Um, but uh, mainly the thing was I was trying to find another night that I could stream that was not uh, at 1030 or 11 o'clock. Uh, and pretty much the only reason for that was because I hated driving at night. See, in the game, I can take it and I can change it to whatever time I want it to be. Multiplayer, I don't have that option. So I had to, I had to um, you know, I had to, I had to be aware of that. It was up there. Shut up. Uh, we did rebuild. Oh yeah. Oh nice man. Oh, you stole a Slurpee. You probably shouldn't do that in a public forum like this. There may be a police officer watching. <laughs> uh, well, it follows the scale to real time. So if uh, if it's nighttime on the server, uh, then it will stay nighttime and there's nothing you can do to change it. So in fact, it doesn't really follow real time, but in a way it kind of does. And this is why I love Mexico, man. You're just not going to find this cool stuff up in the States on, on the SES stuff. Uh, this is the FLD. Make it wide? Yes, man. The Uncle D Logistics. Denver, Colorado. We Don't play VR, just got three wide here on multi monitor, that's all I do. Yeah, Fortnite? Nope. <laughs> nope. I would have to do a different channel to do any kind of Fortnite or any of that other stuff. Hey, what's up there, Maurice? Good to see you, man. Oh, thanks there, uh, Ramirez. Appreciate that. But Digger with Dave, what's up, Highland Guard? What's up, man? I'm sorry about missed you guys up there. Hope you guys are doing well, man. Good to see you. And we had us a really nice giveaway, and uh, Highland Guard was one of our winners, as well as Stefan. 
So I want him in there. And there was two guys earlier. Now, Sim Gaming, I see a, I got an email popped up there on my email. So that was probably yours. Um, so there was one other one, I believe, a Josh. Uh, there was Josh someone. I don't know. This is not Miller. Uh, but there was a Josh there that, that also won. I never got an email from you. So if, if you're here, um, then then make sure you email me there at Full Tilt, uh, Full Tilt Farming. Excuse me. Full Tilt Farming at, uh, at gmail.com. Look at this. They even simulate the road going to going to crap in the hand basket here. Look at this. <laughs> Freaking cool is that, man? <laughs> yeah, I know. Everybody, make, make sure you like it, man. If you guys don't super chat, if you can't do that, can't afford that, don't have your own you know money and all that kind of stuff, go ahead and throw up a like on that. Watch the videos. That's a really good way to support the channel. It really does help. I know uh, everyone tells you to do it. There's a reason why everyone tells you to do it because it actually... Uh, is pretty important and i saw someone ask what steering wheel i am the logitech G g29 with the logitech matching shifter uh and then i've got the uh well it's an skrs but it's not the one from csio it's uh from a plus b software and i'm working on uh i'm an amazon affiliate now so i'm gonna work on getting all of these links to my whole entire setup get everything set up so that you guys will be able to see everything that i'm doing to see all the stuff that i'm using um so that way you know if you got any questions, you'll be able to go to a link and it'll literally have all my stuff all set up there. And that way you guys can see what I am, do a little more research on it, all that kind of good stuff. So, all right there, Johnny, I'm good, man. The test, the t really, the Tesla truck, really? They, they had to go Tesla. <sighs> well, it better be good, man. That's all I got to say. What's up there, EM7? How are you, man? Crazy Crandall, how are you? Uh, having a sound mods for trucks. Yeah, basically the only one that I know of that I use is the 2.5 um, engines, engines and sounds pack, and it's out of the workshop. Okay, we got some more uh, speed bumps here, pulling through town. It's pretty awesome though. I mean, this is cool. Oh, yeah, it'd be nice if it's a little more, a little more up to beat and a few more passengers out there, but you know. It is what it is. Steven Strauman, what's up? <laughs> yeah, no speed, man. Tyler says on what's up, man. Yeah, sorry I missed you back there, man. Just... Ooh, that was a good one. I put the new uh, physics mod in uh, from, uh, what is that? Is that Franken64? I believe I put that in from him, and it's, it's uh, <laughs> yeah, it's pretty good. Pretty good, a little, a little bouncy, but I guess it should be in a truck, right? Hey, what's up there, Mr. Panda, Francisco? What's up, man? Yeah, Mexico's good. Well, this is uh, this is all from a from a map mod done by a one team, um, and I mean they they have literally knocked this whole entire section of this map. They've knocked it clean out of the park this has been so good yesterday it was so good uh, i just I, I yesterday i couldn't even contain half my excitement it was so good oh yeah go <laughs> yeah. oh well thank you there cody appreciate that man that's awesome welcome in mr nathan Pennington. thank you there nathan appreciate the sub there bud well thank you there child appreciate it man now, Adam, you can grab this uh, pretty much any uh, mod site. It's not on Steam, uh, but you can grab it from just about any mod site now. It's uh, Viva Mexico. If you want to Google it up, it's all the same everywhere you get it. There's three parts to it, um, and they've got the load orders and everything. But I am going to finish that video tonight, and I'm going to do a quick video on grabbing this map since we've done now uh, two parts to it. i got to make sure we get our right turn here. Uh, so I'm going to finish that tonight, and it'll be up... I really hope it'll be up by the morning, okay? So look for this uh, tomorrow morning. I'm gonna have the Viva Mexico where you can get it, download it, uh, the mod order, all that good stuff, and that way you guys can uh, can be driving on this yourself. It's totally free, it's not a big DLC, it's nothing crazy like that, uh, but it's absolutely fantastic. Uh oh, getting the gear. Nick Nielsen, thank you there, buddy. Appreciate that, man. Yeah, I am excited for Oregon, man. I am definitely excited for Oregon. Let's get a little third person here pulling in here.
favorite supercar. I don't really have a, a complete favorite supercar. I ain't done. Uh oh, it's gonna be tight. It's gonna be tight. There we go. Uh, what engine? Nope, didn't want to do that. Hang on. Um, I'm not exactly sure, to honestly, to tell you the truth. I want to say it's a Detroit diesel, but honestly, I, I can't remember if I put the Detroit in here or not. <laughs> like three and seven. Yeah, let me get a new thing here. I'll catch up here as well with uh, with some of the chat here. This has been a, a challenging little section here to drive through. So one thing I like about this, so I mean, if you're planning on doing a bunch of big heavy hauls and stuff, man, I don't know, it's going to be tough. And by the way, since Incline is in here too as well, he was asking for this earlier, uh, and I want to make sure that I tell him, uh, I was waiting on 1.3, uh, 3.1 to come out. Oh boy. Oh, that was, that was crazy. So I was waiting on 131 to come out before I did my list. That way we could have uh, fresh updated mods. So uh, I've got about half of that list now. So I'm waiting on some of these other trucks to update so that way we can actually give out proper links to all this stuff. So I just want to let you know, man. <laughs> he asked me a long time ago and I decided I was going to wait till some, for some things to get updated. So, so yeah, now the 131 hit, you know, I'm like, yeah, we're going to do that. So, <laughs> uh, yes, I have there, Eric. And a special thanks there to Mr. Justin Castile uh, for joining in. So appreciate that, man. Yeah, no problem there, Incline. Uh, favorite truck, at least. Uh, whoo! I still like the I still like the 389, but this truck is really growing on me, honestly. And it's mainly just the sound. Uh, that, that's really the the big one with me is the, the way these trucks sound. Uh, if, if you if you can show me a truck that sounds pretty flipping awesome then uh, you might just, you know, you might have a fan. All right, probably should have backed that in. Let's see what we can do here. Oh, wow, they all the way at the corner. Uh, this might be a little bit of a meme. Let's, let's see what we can do, man. Lord Megan, what's up, man? Damien, what's up, man? DDPG phase, how are you there, buddy? Alamendo Mort, what's up, buddy? Yeah, what's well, okay, man? Just glad to see you guys uh, hopping back in, saying hey. Uh, yeah, this would be considered an old school class, I would, I would say. I don't know if I've got the turning radius on this truck. Let's see, let's see what we got here. See if I can, uh, if I can make the, if I can make the original turn, we'll be all right. What's up there, Matt? How are you, man? Uh, no, Damien, I do not. I do not. Embraces Freightliner's reputation for original groundbreaker trucks. <laughs> yeah, uh, groundbreaker and and freight shaker. That's the other nickname that they got. I guess I guess in the cabs they just you know at, at some point, man, they would just you know shake all it up. SFG, yes, this is Viva Mexico. This is a map. 
Uh, so really, I think Viva Mexico means live Mexico, but the map itself is a complete. So I'll show you if we got new guys jumping in here as well. Let me let me tab just uh, let me tap here just for a quick second. All right, there we go. Um, so we got new guys joining us. I'll give you a really quick rundown here. So we're in the Freightliner FLD. Uh, this is new for one through one, although some of the trailers I have are not one through one uh compatible so sometimes the trailer cables work sometimes they don't but here's basically viva mexico viva mexico adds the entire basically almost now we're getting very close to the continent of of uh or the country of mexico uh almost to all this now if you have coast to coast if you have run canada dream any one of those two multi like huge mods they all work with this now so if you're looking forward type in viva mexico 2.4.4 i'm gonna be doing a video on uploading that uh, and putting that in, get all the mods and stuff squared away, and get that up, and I'm gonna have it up by at least my goal is tomorrow morning. Uh, so thank you there, uh, Z Biddle. Wait a minute, we got three coming in. So William Stanzik, thank you for your subscription as well. So, uh, so this is the, all the stuff here. This new uh, area here, Durango, was the new province or state that they added in in 2.4.3. This one here adds in a complete new area here on the bottom side. So all of this down here and all this gray is where we're at right now. So we're fixing to leave Yampa and hopefully, or Yampa, uh, and, uh, or is it I mean, Yampa? Uh, and then we're trying to head this way back into Fresno and then head north. Uh, so there's a couple things in here that I want to try to do and try to get on separate on video just because they're like just really cool videos that'd be really short. So we'll, we'll try to do as much of this in the live stream as we possibly can. So again, thank you there to ZBiddle91 and SFG for y'all's subscription. Appreciate it, guys. One shot. What's up, Jason? XR6T. Hello, man. I'm doing well. Uh, Lord Bacon is eating some bacon. That's no surprise here. And still, the gamer is subscribing. Well, if you wanted to be stealth gamer, man, that was a wrong time to sub to the... Because <laughs> everybody knows you're here now. All right. <clears throat> Let's see what we got in our freight market. <laughs> I had to. That was good. Oh, we got the forklifts. Where are they going? Oh, okay. All right, so we got lumber building materials. We got the forklifts, which is pretty cool. And we got just regular flatbeds. Y'all want to see the forklifts? I think we'll see the forklifts. Let's see the forklifts because the forklifts are cool. Let's do that. Good trailer mods. So there's a couple of new ones. Um, there's a couple of new ones. An oversized pack just went out um, as well. Even though they said it was updated for 131, it's not. So yeah, don't, don't go into that one thinking that it's um, going to work. It, it, it doesn't. But um, there's a couple of good flatbeds. So if you like the American style flatbed trailers, they still work. Um, there's another one in the States and I may just go get it and bring it down here just to like take it somewhere just cause it's really cool. Uh, but it's like three trucks stacked on top of one another. It's, uh, I really like it. All right, so let's see. So I think, okay, it looks like our, okay. All right, so we're going to have to go down here and then uh, go through uh, Yalpa and then pick up there. And then we'll reroute ourselves around so we take some more cool roads. So. Yeah, it's good SFG, man. If you're uh, if you're downloading the, uh, the Viva Mexico, man, you'll love it. It's good. It's got some spots in it, though, where I've seen some texture clashing around and thrashing, which means you got like textures that flicker back and forth, like you've got two stacked on top of one another. So there's probably a, a good bit, especially in the cities, there's a lot of optimization that needs to happen. Um, but I, I don't have a problem unless I'm putting all the stream forward and um, I'm running everything, running both cameras and all that kind of stuff. And I can tell there's a little bit of a, a little bit of a, a thing, but it's not in a frame rate issue. It's like it's having trouble is getting hung up on a few things that aren't loading. Um, so I, you know, I would have looked for there to be an update to this probably fairly soon now that they've actually gotten it out there and you know, people got a chance to really test it through the masses. They always do this and they'll put a couple updates just kind of clean, clean everything up. So I don't know where that truck just went. It just disappeared on me. <laughs> Yeah, disco textures kind of, it, it does. I mean, it, you know, it happens. Yeah, I, the thing that I that I have just been completely enamored with this whole entire update has been um, everything just driving uh, the interchanges are crazy, especially on the north side end of Durango. Um, Man, if you haven't seen it, go back and watch last night's stream, just like the first 20, 30 minutes of it. I mean, it's crazy. 
And of course you can see the level of excitement I have. I'm still excited about it tonight just because it's new stuff, man. It's good stuff. All right, let's see what we got here. Uh, all right, there's that. All right, so we'll grab this and then we'll go ahead and uh, then we'll go ahead and reroute ourselves. Hey, what's up there, Bob? Yeah, I'm talking to Sam. <laughs> Alright, there's our uh, some nice 8R series here, some old school 8R series, root crops. Got too many heavy hauls. Well the flatbeds aren't heavy hauls, which is a good thing. They're they're a little oversized. Um, they're a little bit big and cumbersome, but they're not like, you know, they're not like out of the, out of the bounds of, of, you know, too much. <laughs> I'll give you that old really handsome taco stand. I don't know. Um, there we go. Uh, needs to add Texas. Yeah, I think... Uh, Oregon, I would imagine they might just go ahead and do Washington. That's just my, maybe my, my one maybe. Um, other than that, I have heard, at least rumored, I have heard um, both Utah and Colorado. And thank you there to the King J. Appreciate it, man. Appreciate that sub. Well, thank you there, Sales. Appreciate that, man. It's a good sim setup. You know, sim drivers, if you like the sims and the wheels and uh, flight sim stuff, I do, I do quite a bit of that. So yeah, yeah, you know, it, it's perfect for that. Yeah, it is, Lord Bacon. It's good, man. It's a good chill. It's a good chill game. Bearded muscle, thank you there for the sub, man. Appreciate that. All right, let's not get taken out by the Greyhound. All right, so from there, let's let's go ahead and let's let's redo our mapping here because what we're going to do is go south. Uh, and then let's 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 get up at least into right here. Let's see what happens. Uh, is it gonna take us? Nope. All right. Well, let's make it go that way. All right. So there's that. And where's this stopping us back in? Is that gonna take us? Um, all right. So let's maybe. I'm gonna stop it up here. We'll stop up here and plan on getting gas. Right, our second marker there. We'll stop there in Fresnillo, and then we'll try to go north. Like maybe we'll try to go uh, Valparaiso. Maybe we'll try to go into here and maybe see one of these roads or a couple of this here. I'll save a couple of these in for some other uh, other stuff. I've got some other surprises for some videos and stuff. Um, but we'll we'll see how we get along here with this tonight. You going there, Bob? Have a good man. Well, thanks there, Cody. Appreciate it, man. How are you there, Beard Muscle? Good to see you, man. Oh, you're just being nice. Okay, I got you, man. <laughs> you just gotta be nice to the guys that have to sleep. I don't have to sleep, but you know, I'll be nice to them. Alright, so we're going to see some pretty cool roads here, man. This, this is going to be nice. I think you guys will like this. I'm excited about it. Uh, how do you get this part? So, uh, so, so 10,100? I don't know, man. We'll, <laughs> we'll see. I have no idea, man. I, I don't like to guess subs. I... I kind of started doing that, you know, through Gold Rush, and I've kind of just learned, you know what, I'm appreciative for what I have, so I'm just going to let it roll with that. Uh, if people want to subscribe and people want to stay active with the channel, then, I, you know, I, I definitely would like like people to do that. Yeah, it's, yeah, Jose, it's okay, man, yeah, Michael's just, yeah, it, it's, I, I don't really answer frivolous stuff, so just, uh, you know, keep in conversation, man, and, and all will be fine, all will be fine. So now that Mr. Mike Lee is here, uh, so so the thing with 10K, so while we're kind of getting ready to get on this really crazy road stuff, which it, it looks like it's going to be a whole heck of a lot of fun. Um, so before we get into all this good stuff here, 
um, I wanted to find out and this week I want you guys to come back in I'm gonna be streaming uh, some ATS and unless any other kind of big updates come out with anything else it'll be some ATS maybe uh, maybe in some I don't know I may do a live stream just to see how it does uh, I actually do have the 389 fibers in ETS so I mean I guess that's a potential possibility we still enjoy the roads and still enjoy the 389 in Europe <laughs> uh, but anyway this truck and streets this week I'm gonna start doing some straw polls and put those together tonight or tomorrow um, because we're gonna start merchandise so merchandise I said always said was 10k was my goal uh, and then after that so I'm gonna be putting things up like what kind of shirt do you want what kind of colors do you like because what I'm gonna do is do a limited kind of run of some of this stuff um, and then see how it see what you guys think see if you like it if it sells then I'll keep doing it if I need to back up and punt do something else then I'll, I'll consider those as well um, but the main thing is just getting an idea from you guys of what you want because uh, you guys are gonna be the buyers and sellers now the thing is I'm gonna be doing it at a better t-shirt price rate because I'm gonna do it myself I'm gonna have them run myself I'm gonna keep them here so that means I can give them away when I want to give them away I can ship them out when I want to ship them out uh, and then we can do it as cheap as we can still get you guys you know a good product for less than what you pay for anybody's shirts at Teespring and probably the quality uh, would be 10 times better so doing stuff like I've got some other other small item stuff too like stickers you know Michael's been been asking forever for a hat so we got to get a hat for Michael uh, but just little stuff like that so be be aware of that be looking for those and plug in on those and, and vote when you ever get a chance it really would help me out because um, after all it'd be stuff that you guys might would want uh, here in the future so I just want to make sure you guys have that opportunity so so yeah man absolutely hey what's up there V Mr. V one of these days I'll take a chance at, at getting his name right but until then I just noticed too that this is a split windscreen. Tan hat. <laughs> Bob is funny, man. <laughs> uh, and said barrel is yes. This is the F the FLD. You are right. Ooh, we about took his front fender, but that's all right. We're good. So we're in the Viva Mexico, so we are now uh, coming up uh, the back end here, I think, of Quasimoto, I believe. Uh, we'll switch camera views here. Uh, sometimes the daytime and on this particular part of the Mexico update can get kind of washed out from the camera. Uh, let's do a little, uh, let's do a little third person. Oh man, look at that, look at that down there. Maybe y'all may have missed that.
too many trains though. I wish you'd take the trains out of there. That's completely unrealistic and stupid. They're allowed to have this 400 horsepower truck take this, uh, you know, I don't know, like 300 ton train somewhere. Yeah, like that happens. <laughs> Uh oh, we hit another invisible wall. That happens sometimes. I think that uh, I think that whatever that that vegetation is out there was a little too much for it. Oh, whoops! Here we go. I we'll have to watch our vegetation there. We got we stuck our stuck our nose out a little too close there. Yeah, grass on the road. <laughs> that, that that shut us down though. <laughs> <laughs> channel appreciate the subscription Whoop, there's more more bushes in the road we'll have to steer clear of those <laughs> Mexican grass is dense yeah <laughs> y'all can see the map we're fixing to come up to this is uh this is pretty cool man this is good stuff this is what ATS dreams were made of Old song like in the 80s, maybe early 90s. Uh, when did when did I get the mod? Uh, the back flatbed delivered to the place of wish. Pick up load, nice truck, and drove that to for the Oh yeah. Whoop! Just about got him there. Hey, what's up there, Calvin? Oh my gosh. <laughs> This is going to be fun. Challenging, that's what I say. You want me driving these roads? Hey, what's up there? Is that... Is that uh, Jacobian Dixon? Jacobian, is that right? Swanger wide, I know, man, right? <laughs> oh, wow, Bob. Yeah, if they added neighborhood, absolutely, man. Yeah, that would be. <laughs> well, they'd have to do that, or they'd have to have a really good level of detail, uh, distance draw tools and stuff in there for modders and stuff to use. That's <laughs> the only way they could do it, man. Hi right, there, Josh. Have a great one, man. Appreciate you guys coming out and hanging out here, especially on our uh, our intro here to our uh, our 10K sub. So big, big kind of a special a special night indeed tonight. So appreciate all your guys' support, man. Altitude, uh, was that 2,670 meters? Because we've climbed at least some of this. Well, thank you there, Bob. Appreciate it, man. All right, that'd be sweet if all this is downhill. There's quite a few places on this, man. You can definitely lose it, man. It doesn't take much on these. Oh, you know what this means. Ha! <laughs> 
<laughs> Turn right now. <laughs> All right, this is a little something I always used to do here. So if those guys are like, what are you doing now? Yeah, so we're going to always take my, my, we'll take our picture here. I guess we could have got a little bit closer there. Uh, container stackers, that's exactly what they look like. Uh, it looks like they're maybe the smaller ones. Like you do the, the half trailer ones. I don't, I can't remember. They, they, those things have a particular name to them. Yeah, it is Lawrence. Actually, it is pretty decent. I normally, uh, nowadays people, people, uh, you know, they want to hear a Jake break over anything else. Oh, look, that guy was even doing the same thing I was. All right, let's see what we can get going here. Something like, yeah, you're right there, Calvin. Oh, man. There's another one. This one's even better. <laughs> what if I fell off that in slab stream? <laughs> My God, how bad would that be? <laughs> that would be terrible. Well, thank you there, Quinn. Appreciate that. Thank you for the subscription, guys. Yeah, I was trying to get somewhere good. I could get the actual cliff in the... There we go. Yeah, that, there we, that way we can kind of back up off. You can see more of the road here. <laughs> oh, yeah. I don't know there, M7. Yeah, I'm, I'm good on my end, man. All right. That, that's pretty good there. All right. So we'll do the... Or strength, yeah, oh, uh, yeah. Then the one thing about this mod that I've noticed, there's not a lot of level detail. I don't know if you guys can see it, but you look all the way in the far. That's that's where eventually one of the towns that we're going. That's where we're going through. So, um, they really that probably shouldn't be drawing this far this way. So, um, I, I think you're probably going to have to have a pretty massive uh, computer to run this mod effectively. Probably more so than what you would uh, on any of the other ones so and thank you there mr kyle appreciate that subscription as well there bud yeah low screen worthy absolutely man absolutely <laughs> the ultimate pull of the 50 g i know right man thank you there connor barber thank you for that man appreciate it All right, I'm curious here in chat, what what do you guys, do you guys like this screen? Uh, do you like this one that it's on right now just to kind of get you out the uh, the window? Or do you guys like uh, the, the triple across? Just curious. You guys feel, feel free to let me know. Or if you like a mix. I even forgot. I, I haven't even put this on there. I, I meant to put that on there before. I just totally forgot. This cab's a little weird, though, because it's so boxy, but I, I can only move so far back before it starts looking stupid on my end. Makes it hard to drive. Like both. Yeah, mixed. Yeah, it's you know it's kind of good. The only thing bad thing about this, which is kind of like the sucky thing with the stream, is I really would sit further back. It's easier to watch um, from your guys' perspective, but it's hard to play it because your front windows like wind up being like way up here on the front corner, uh, and it's hard to play it in that in that frame. So. That's why I try to try to switch it up because I know being this far up on the dashboard really sometimes isn't you know all that much fun either. So you know, just don't get a, a really good feel for the spatial uh, you know spatial recognition inside the mind. So that's, that's the only thing. Oh, it makes you feel like you you're okay for you riding with me. <laughs> yeah. Okay, well good. We'll get y'all like both. All right. Well, I'll, I'll just keep kind of periodically going between both. 
The only thing, you know, that's bad about this bottom one down here that I'm waving at is, is sometimes it can look washed out on the screen. Uh, it just depends on what time of day and where the sun's shining in. And Because I've got another light right here that, you know, it's like right here's the camera and I've got a light over here. So it, it, I think it picks up some of that ambient lighting. So I just need to rework some things here to get a, get a little better look. Tap the motion. What's up, man? How are you? Hope you guys are doing well. So welcome all the new guys in here. We got new viewers, so welcome to you guys. We are in the Viva Mexico mod 2.4.4. This is a brand, well, it's a brand new updated mod. And we were riding here in the Freightliner FLD 120. Uh, so this has been updated there. This is all in the Steam Workshop. Uh, so this is not like one of those far out mods. This is, you know, one of the one of the good ones there. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> That's been a building process, one shot. Been a building process, man. Well, thank you there, Jake Brown. Appreciate that subscription as well, man. You guys keep those coming in. So don't forget to subscribe if you like it. Uh, and don't forget to just like the video, man. If you want to support the channel and you like what you see, uh, definitely do that. Whoa, here we go. So I guess this is supposed to give you the, the feeling that the road's all tore up here. I'd say they do a pretty good job. Oh, yeah, no problem, Charles. Well, I mean, you guys are the ones watching. You know, so if I didn't ask you which view you liked, and you said, well, I like the triple view, and I never went to the triple view, well, guess what? You probably wouldn't watch anymore. <laughs> you'd be like, oh, man, I really wish you'd do that. We'll go find another YouTuber out there that does it. I'm sure there's one. <laughs> Josh Taylor, what's up, my Australia? Hey, man, you didn't you win, Josh Taylor? Didn't you win? Uh, didn't you win one of the giveaways last uh, couple nights ago? I think you did. Let me know if you did. Yeah. Oh, absolutely, man. Absolutely, dude. There's so much in this new update, man. It's not even funny. I don't know if they touched much of the other one. The other one is still pretty good. But man, this new stuff, man. Some of these cities, dude, they're they're they are detailed, like way more than you would actually, you know, think that they would be. I'm I'm, I'm still surprised, man. Riding around some of this stuff, I'm like, wow. I mean, almost kind of brought it to an SES level. Yeah, I think so too, Josh. I never got an email from you, so um, I've actually got what you won. Actually, Let's see what was it you won. I had it on here. Yeah, you wore the heavy haul mod. Uh, so I never got an email from you, so I have not been able to get that to you. So if you would, send me an email at fulltiltfarming at gmail. Not full tilt gaming, but full tilt farming. Or you can send me an invite there on Steam. Just make sure I know what your Steam name is so I know which one uh, of the many that are there, I know which one is you. And that you'll be given a free copy there of the heavy haul. Yeah, I know, Jake. Yeah, some of them are. Um, it's something about their their mass is, is off. Um, hopefully, an update or a fix to that uh, in 1.31, hopefully, will fix that. I hope. Some trailers have it, some don't. But I know exactly what you mean. Uh, yeah, I'll send it tonight. Y'all check my email and send it tonight, man. I'll try to do this and get that video done for you guys. Uh, so we'll have that done and out of the way. Looks like we got some spotty rains coming in. Oh my god. Stay off the vegetation. <clears throat> uh, am I driving the cab villa? No. I, and I, yeah, I need to do that a little better here. So that's what we're in. We're in the Uncle D Logistics on uh, the Freightliner FLD. It's still an absolute fantastic mod, don't get me wrong. I just say it's, it's always good sometimes, though, to get a new break. And honestly, it kind of it, it kind of gives me an idea of what people want to see. Because some people don't want to see anything else but 389. Yep. No lie. Like, they won't watch it if it's not 389. Oh, he's not driving to Peterbilt. I'm not going to watch Oh, he's driving a cheap freight shaker. Um, I'm not watching. 
I, I can't do it. I can't do it. <laughs> Um, uh, what is the heavy all mod is the difference the heavy transport yes well the heavy all mod adds all the trailers and that's the DLC package now the special transport I don't think there's a heavy transport there's a special transport that's coming out which is going to add pilot cars and really ridiculously oversized special stuff that will go out and block roads and everything for you um, the, the heavy haul mod just adds really heavy uh, really heavy trailers like on um, you know, on, on stuff. So um, I don't know if that's exactly what you're asking for. You may, if, if I didn't answer that, then just you know, let me know. Yeah, it's getting so bad. I know, man. It's good. It's a good mod. It's got a lot of options on it, um, and it sounds good when you got the sound pack stuff to go with it, man. I mean, it sounds good. It looks good. It, it drives really good. Um, I don't know. I mean, this one and the the, the cab over, man. I, I like both of them. Both of them are really good. Oh, well, thank you there, Sam Gaming. Well, listen, man. You guys do that when you can. Uh, I was also telling uh, earlier, I'll tell, especially if you've got any guys here as well. I always get every now and again people come in and say, you know, hey, Deputy Paul. Hey, okay, well, thank you there, Deputy Paul. Appreciate that, man. Thank you there for your subscription. So, like guys always ask, you know, well, how can I support or what's the best way? I've got some some different ratios of, of what I get just as a gamer between the different services. Whether it's Super Chats, Streamlabs, you know, PayPal, those are all three good. But also, if you just don't have the money, people say, well, I don't have any money to give you, man. I'm, I'm kind of younger. I don't really, I've got a job, but, you know, it's I'm buying wheels for the truck or I'm doing this. But I still want to support you, but I just don't have money. Well, go like some videos, you know, go, go find some previous ATS videos, go throw a like up on them. Go throw one up. Go go let it you know go let it you know watch in your uh, in the background while you're doing something else you know um, doing some homework or you're kicking around playing another game. Just play it on you know in the background or something. Every little bit of that stuff it all helps. So um, you can still support stuff without giving money. There's still lots that can be done and lots of ways you can be helpful. So don't forget about those kinds of things. Don't ever get you know beat down thinking oh I don't I just don't have money this week to you know to do anything. Uh, all that stuff it really does help. I, I really mean that it does help. What's up, Mr. Kenworth98? How are you, man? Hope you're doing good. Uh, Shelton Ponder, no, I do not. I do not have the Coast to Coast mod. I don't really like it. Um, I would normally just leave it and put it there, but a lot of times the jobs, man, uh, you know, a lot of the jobs and stuff that have that, they always they always come up and, and wind up, um, I don't know, man. They, they wind up taking everything way across uh, way across the, the spectrum, so I just, I don't know, man. I, I, don't, ever, I don't ever mess around with it. The same way with Canada Dream, you wind up getting these jobs like out of LA and it'd be the one trailer I want to drive, and then you look at it and it's like, well, if we're going to New York City and you're like, no, I ain't doing that. <laughs> oh, it's okay, Sim Game. I know what you mean. I just saw that and it just made me think about that. Some people, um, you know, they always get a little insecure about that. I'm always I'm always chilling, like, yeah, you know, don't you don't worry about that, man. It's, it's all good. All good. Been trucking. Good man. Oh, Ince4, what's up, man? I know FTG, what's up, buddy? Ince4 is all the way, I believe, in Netherlands, I believe. Stay Spress, what's up? How are you? Good to see you guys. Henry Gaudieri, good live, friend. Greetings from Uruguay. Awesome. What is it? Uruguay, yeah. Oh, that's cool, man. All the way down to South America. Welcome. I guess we could uh, we could at least turn on a little bit of uh, windshield wipers here. Maybe our lines. Ah, uh, show which one. Oh, coast to coast always crashes. Yeah, I, I just don't like it, man. I, it's a cool concept. Don't get me wrong, man. I'm telling you, dude. If, if oh Latvia, that's right, Latvia, that's right. Well, there's there's plenty of stuff. I'm telling you, Shell. This is a really good mod. Viva Mexico 2.4.4 just literally recently updated. I'm gonna do a video on it tonight. Have that up in the morning and stuff. It's so good, man. It, this puts any this puts any of the coast to coast stuff. This literally puts all of that to shame. Because a lot of this stuff is all custom. It's not just your general, uh, you know, same stuff like from um, uh, from SES. You know, it's really good. It's really good, man. Uh, is there a freeway? Well, I'm I wonder there uh, if you're asking. Well, I mean, potentially it might be what we're fixing to turn on. 
I'm not exactly sure, man. I'm, I'm, I'm a stranger. I'm a stranger to the area. <laughs> happen can I get through here oh please don't be a uh... <sighs> oh there's a cop oh god <laughs> all right would this be the freeway that you were uh, talking about <laughs> is there a freeway I don't know hang on let me cross the median I'm sure there is <laughs> Ah, I do not know when they're going to release that shell. I really don't know. <laughs> that was funny, man. Hey, what's up there, John? Go, how are you, man? Let's see how do that one. Yeah, that was good, man. Hey, is there a freeway near you? Oh, God, there it is. <laughs> that was good, man. Running down the road. Oh, well, this oh, thank you there, Stacey. Big shout out there to Stacey for riding down the road and listening to your favorite YouTuber. Well, you guys are favorite viewers. Uh, thank you. The big 10K today. Uh, so that is a big, huge milestone. So y'all will just have to, to, to deal with deal with that. So really just about a, a little over a year here uh, on uh, on YouTube. Seriously, anyway. We, we did, um, I guess, about a year and I guess we're up to like three or four months, seriously, uh, on here. So... Uh, at least as uh, actively putting on videos and that kind of stuff. So thank you guys, big thumbs up for 10K. Um, such a such a great milestone to hit that. So uh, I don't know how we I don't know how things go from here. So hopefully it just continues to boop, 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 boop. going up 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 up. Uh, when when are you going to live streams? Uh, I'm sure you probably meant to put something else out there. I'll let you re-ask that. <laughs> Try the mod is great. Well, good. Yeah, it's it's awesome. Can't go wrong with this one. It, this one's a good one. What do I think of the name Full Tilt Gaming? Oh, it's a great name, man. Absolutely fantastic. And I've been doing live streams, honestly, since we started. Uh, I started as predominantly a Farm Sim 17 a PS4 channel. Uh, and then we branched out. I decided, man, I've got to get into PC stuff. I've got to get into some of those mods. You know, I've got to get into yada yada this and yada yada that. So here we are uh, now doing some truck and ETS, ATS. We've got flight sims on the channel. If you like x -Plane, you will see I've got a really awesome setup for that. I've uh, been doing a little bit of racing as well, so we're starting to uh, collect some things here on those uh, on those sims as well. So it's it's just an ever building channel. You know, anytime I do things, it seems that we just kind of add to here and there, and um, it's really cool, man. It's it, it's it wouldn't happen any other way. It's it's really good. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> what? Uh, yeah, I, I, I get that now, Ryan. I was looking at your question, your, your statement, going, like, what? See, what is Ryan doing, man? He's really off his bucket. I'm like, well, I guess I probably just need to be in the team speaker. <laughs> I, I know, right, Gray, but I, I didn't mean that to come out the way it did. Well, I started when I started, guy. It just caught me off guard. So I've got a video, if you want to see. Uh, Shelton there, I've got a video in the bottom of the description, all the way at the bottom, uh, that's got all my specs, what I've got in it, uh, just kind of showcase the computer as well, so you can kind of see what it is, um, and um, you know, get an idea.
Hey, y'all have a great, yeah. Uh, typically 10.30 um, is my go time. Now, it's going to be a little bit earlier. Uh, we've been able to get the little one up in her room now, so uh, the wife is going to retreat back to our room to, uh, to, to do whatever she wants to do in there. Uh, watch TV, kick back without having to wake the baby up. So I'll be able to start hopefully a little bit earlier, which may open a door for some more multiplayer at a different time so that we can do some trucking during the, the um, so we do some trucking during the, the earlier hours, hopefully. Um, so yeah, so I mean, I, I don't know. I mean, uh, typically it's probably going to be 10 o'clock at, at a, you know, at an honest, honest trade is going to be 10. Yeah, can you hear the Jake break? Absolutely. Let me, let me speed her up. Here we go. Turn your ears up. I'll shut up. Inside. Outside. not many places you're gonna go here a truck that sounds better than that right there I'm just sorry it just doesn't exist that right there didn't bring a rep never mind I can't say that I can't say that I can't say that that's terrible you can't bring it <laughs> well thank you there's help presented man 1055 heck yeah man welcome to all the new 55 members appreciate it guys crazy times man crazy times Hey, what's up there, Mr. Worldwide? How are you there, buddy? Yeah, beard muscle, I know, man. Especially that over the over the top, man. We might just ride the rest of the stream in that view. That's freaking bad at the bone, man. I don't know if you hear this truck or not. If you turn your ears up, and I'm going to talk a little quieter. You can actually hear this shaking inside the cab. Ironic that they call it the freight shaker. There it is. Thank you there, Sheldon. Sheldon said, I think I'll get my shot out now. So welcome, buddy. Jalen, oh boy, what's up, man? All right, we, we let you have fun yesterday, man. You're going to have to straighten it up. I straighten it up today, man. Time to put the big boy pants on. <laughs> uh, I wonder if this... Uh, I, you know what? I'm... You know, so so here's the thing about that uh, tap. Um, the one thing about that is, I guess that's a, a little bit. So in computer terms, just like these things, like I say, like level of distance. Oops, I had the red light. Crap. Um, the level of distance, the level of detail drawing and stuff that comes out with maps like this. Sometimes if they, if the map maker does not put a lot of care into optimization, sometimes it can be pretty bad um this one does not have a lot of optimization so you do have to have a pretty hefty computer to run the in the interiors i mean you can kind of see driving down the road like all of these trees with all of these concrete and all these you know rock pads and stuff in here you would normally see that in real life but do you need to have all of that stuff in the cities to make them look realistic my guess is no you don't um, I want to see more action more than I want to do see anything else. But I mean, you know, if you've got the computer to run stuff like this, then yeah, there's no doubt in my mind, at least from what I've seen so far, that this is my favorite part. This, com this for me, completely smokes New Mexico because New Mexico, um, even though they're charging like fourteen or fifteen dollars for it, it still only gives you a couple of really decent cities, and the roads are all interstate. I mean, the thing about this, we've been driving for now an hour and 22 minutes. And honestly, yesterday, we drove for almost two hours yesterday. And we still did not run across one road that looked exactly the same as any of the other roads. And we still haven't today. And we're actually going into a city that we went into, but, but because we're coming at it from a totally different angle, like it looks totally different. Um, so, I mean, that, that, you know, that's kind of what I mean. I mean, when, when a map is done right, it gives you the sense that you're really in uh, uh, not a not a far out place, but it, it gives you the sense that you're really in a realistically modeled place, that it's not generic. I don't ride by 
you know, this particular, like this over here, this, what, what is this? What is this? This world's famous winner's ring bar. Like, I don't know that I remember seeing that anywhere else. Maybe that's just local to this particular area and they've modeled it in. I don't know, but I don't see them littered all over the map like you do Ray's, Ray's hamburger bar or whatever that thing is that they have on the California side. So, I mean, having all that custom stuff in there, um, it, it's so cool to see all that. So, I mean, to me, that's what makes a really good map when you can really go in and feel like you are really in a different place. Um, I know just for example, uh, we did ETS about, mm, let's say probably about a month ago, we went and did the Japan module, which is right, three cities on the coastline of Japan, and it looked absolutely, um, absolutely awesome. And because it looked like we were in, it had all these custom objects in, all these custom buildings, custom bridges, all the roads and stuff were just absolutely insane. And it may really made you feel like you were in Japan. Um, so that's kind of, you know, that's just, that's just for me, that's just a few things just that I like to see when it comes to these things. They don't have to be perfect, you know, by any means. They just gotta work and they gotta be fun. And I'm telling you what, I have had a blast driving on this because I'm looking at all this stuff, all of the lights, you know, on, on, under all of the interstates and stuff. I mean, if I go back and think of how many lines and stuff there is, like in the California, Nevada, Arizona, DLC and stuff, like I don't remember there being a lot of this stuff. Um, you know, the medians and stuff all have decorations in them. All of these road signs, the constant guardrails. I mean, there's some of that there, but it's like, it's totally like in a different scale. It's, I almost say it's weird, but it, but it is weird. Um, I don't know, it's just, they've just done a really good job, man. That, that's all I can say. They've just done a really good job. Uh, absolutely, Nick. First off, you want to take your flower. I don't know what to do with it there. Um, guess we gotta go this way? I guess. Sure. Looks It looks good to me, right? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> uh, what trucks do you have on one? Uh, what do you mean? What trucks do I have on one ATS? You mean on a profile? Is that what you mean? What's up, JB29? Man, it's been a long time. Hope you're doing well there, buddy. Blaine, what's up? Hello, man. How are you? Oh, how many total mods? I'll let you guys see when we get done. Um, I don't know. It's probably up to... I don't know. It's probably up close to 40, 40, 45, somewhere in that neighborhood, give or take five. Yeah, no, I got no clue, man. What's up, LB? Um, what trucks? Oh, we got on ATS. Uh, well, we got the FLD. We've got this one, the 120. We got the FLB 2.2. Uh, 2. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. Uh, so we got the FMB, which is the cab over. We got the K100, K200. Now I've got a bunch of uh, play. I've got a bunch of stuff that um, has not updated yet. 609, 908, the Max Superliner. Um, what's the other one? The 690. We got the T800. We got the 900B. We got the W900. We got the 389, 379, 359. So I don't know. Probably about uh, maybe eight. Maybe, maybe eight or nine trucks. Now, I would say probably about four of those haven't got a good 1.31 solid update yet, so I'm still kind of waiting on those. Hey, I got one of those. Uh, I've got a feeling I probably should be in the middle lane besides this one. All right, we'll go this way. Bobby, I got 300. What's up? Oh, my God. Where, was I on the wrong side of the road? I think I was. See, all these transitions, like, this this is crazy crap, man. There's no way in the world you'd see uh, SES doing all this. All these road signs telling you every, every single which place to go. It's crazy. It's 
crazy sauce, man. I show the trucks? Well, you won't be able to see them. I mean, you'll be able to see the picture of them. That's about it. Um, I, I won't be able to, like, load them up because they don't actually work in 131 yet. At least some of them don't. Oh, boy. Easy there, killer. Getting awful close. Close for comfort over there. I gotta get over. Alright, let's go outside and see what we got here. Thank you there, Shelter. Appreciate that, man. <laughs> nice, Gray Bog. <laughs> How can Braille stop you? Bye, give you water. <laughs> hey, what's up, Colin? Oh, they always do, man. They always do. Somebody always comes in to be a hater, man. Thank you there, Playboy B21. Hey, 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 hey. It's all of a sudden not suitable for advertisers. Welcome there to you, bud. Hey, Johnny Olivier, what's up? How much do we pay? It's a building process. Um, I, don't, I really don't honestly know uh, how much it costs from start to finish. I mean, I've got a, a good idea how some things cost, but it's all built in one particular part and another. You know, we did this and we did that and we did that. And that. So we've been over the course of a year. And also, welcome in Deontay Chaney. So thank you there, Deontay. Appreciate it, man. Hey, Quantum Mechanics, that's going to be, uh, that'll be here in the next 30 minutes there, uh, Nick, so, uh, just in time there, brother. Thank you there, Jonathan, appreciate it, man. Uh, still building setup. I wouldn't, whoa, whoa, whoa. I wouldn't say it's still building. It depends on what we get into, <coughs> to what we get into it. Uh, I am probably not building any more screens. Uh, set up what I you want me to, ooh, boy this has got really tight here man. so normally what I'm building up on or stuff like um, you know controls mechanisms to make the streams go better those kinds of things um, that's you know that would be my only thing like you know I might would add a button box or you know uh, something like that or I, I don't know what else whatever else I could come up with I would maybe add something like that to it it's kind of like farm sim you know farm sim you can do steering wheel the gas the controller then you can also add joysticks so that you can do um, everything else all in that you know you can do everything all in that um, you know both joysticks for for the tractors whether you're using combine controller anything else so, I mean most of it just comes down to using it for controllers Yes, Audrana, yes, it is. Map is a mod. It is free, and it is awesome and free. I do not have a CDL there, Jalen. I never really thought about it, man. Um, I mean, I enjoy trucks. If I knew somebody that said, hey, man, you can come drive the truck anytime you want to. We'll just take it up the road and back. I'll teach you how to do it. I'd be like, heck, yeah, I'm there. But then I, I do that knowing that I'm going to be getting out of the truck and not having to do it for a job. So... I don't think I would enjoy doing it every day. You know what I mean? I don't. I don't enjoy driving my truck every day. You know, my my my, my actual car. So I, I would feel like at some point this would feel like a truck to me. Uh, I don't know how much the quantum mechanic is. Uh, we did we do we did from time to time. We haven't done it in a while. Um, although if I can stream earlier and we can catch the before. Uh, on the server time and catch some daylight to where it actually is better to watch and stream. Only reason I'm not doing it now is because these cities are lit up like Christmas trees, so I'm not really too worried about, um, you know, you guys not being able to see because, I mean, it's kind of hard not to. But we may we may return back to doing some stuff and actually stream it on there. Let's see what it looks like here. Let's see how washed out it looks. Yeah, it's not too bad. Control this for a few minutes. Oh, better hurry, better hurry, better hurry, better hurry. 
Uh, where do we get most of my mods from? It depends, man. I mean, a good, a good probably half of what I do uh, comes out of the Steam Workshop. Um, I'd say the other half probably comes out of stuff like modsats.com or, um, I mean, gosh, any of that, any of the other normal sites and stuff that people get mods from. Why don't we play them all too? All my computer. I've got one 3.0 hub on the top that just kits some small stuff like uh, my headphone charger, the headphone uh, little front unit there, and um, what's the other thing? Oh, one of my other cameras. So everything else, I've got uh, I've got eight I've got eight total USB plugins there on uh, on my computer. So yeah, it, it gets a little busy, but it works. All right, here we go. Woo! Ironic, this is actually where we started this stream. Come on, turn and radius, don't fail me now. Alright, let's see what in the world we got here. I probably am not gonna be able to back it in. Are we gonna try it, guys? We gotta try it. Uh, Streamlabs, uh, Streamlabs OBS there, I see gaming. Uh, Travis, I will be, uh, this is a 18 speed. Hey, what's up there, Sun Dew man? Good to see you, man. Is that Rajad Poke? Hello, man, how are you? Uh, I've looked at the box as the air brake. Yes. Yes, that's the one I'm talking about, man. Ben Harvey, what's up there, buddy? Uh, what truck would I want to have? Jalen says. Hmm. Hey, Deuce, man. What's up, dude? I almost missed you up there, man. Hope you're doing well there, pal. Uh, Jalen, I, I would have to say probably... Honestly, I'm going to go on a limb here. I honestly would like one of the cab overs. I don't really care which one either. I don't care if it's a Freightliner cab over. I don't care if it's that or... I mean, honestly, I just like the cab overs. I don't know why. I just do. All right. Let's, let's see if we can actually make this work. I, I really think we can. I'm going to try to do it all in, in interior-wise, too, here. Oh, nice, man. Well, yeah, it'll be good to see him come home, man. Is he, uh, is he a truck driver as well? Oh, yeah. I hear you, Deuce. Well, thank you there, buddy. How was the, uh, how was the trip, man? I too much. Hey! Well, thank you there, Sun Dew. Appreciate it, man. Sun Dew Mountain Dew coming in with the $2 super chat. know if we got too much on that we might drive it through the fence back there right, what's going on here oh nice man that's right you do sound do some festivals and stuff like that I doing a big festival is that what y'all were doing yesterday Hey, what's up, Alejandro? How are you, man? So, I, I guess, really, I, I could... Well, shoot, y'all can't even see those. Oh, hang on a minute. I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna try something here. Hang on. Oh, wait a minute here. All right, let's see. Let's see, what, what do I do here? I forgot. There it is. Okay, there's that. Now, I can put these up, and then that way y'all can see better. 
I'll make this my backup cam. How about that? Oh my god, he's close. He's gonna miss it. He's gonna miss it. He's gonna screw it up. There it is. Woo, yeah. Have to get to work. All right, well, thank you there, son. Do appreciate that, man. And if you guys are noticing, also, we've had quite a few sponsors in, so appreciate you guys coming in and hanging out with us as well. Uh, sponsors, all the guys here in the green. And uh, let me go back to this screen here. So they're all in the green. And also, their, their markings here also differentiate who they are and how long they've been sponsored up with the channel uh, as well. So you got one month, two months, and then I think the next one is six months. Uh, and then one year and two years. We don't have any of those yet because sponsorships have only been going for a short amount of time. So, you know, we don't have to wait on that. So um so anyway so thanks guys i think that's gonna be it for us today i want to do one more part and then i'm gonna do some videos with some of the other cooler roads uh, and put that out as well just as kind of some some secondary but i think two or three parts here on mexico is gonna be good and then hopefully we'll have some other trucks we'll have some other trailers i have some stuff like that that we can actually like actually set aside and feature now the one thing i'm gonna do right after stream here is i'm gonna go ahead and try to finish up our viva mexico mod so if you're watching this later on maybe say tomorrow or maybe uh by let's see what's today sunday maybe by monday tuesday wednesday somewhere in that neighborhood uh be checking in later because i'm going to have that video uploaded here so it'll be all down there in the modding uh mod showcase we'll put viva mexico down there as well so we'll take a map overview i'll show you how to put it in i'll show you load orders uh exactly how to stack it in and how to put it where to put it in all your mods and then as long as you go download it then you're really you're really good to go so that's really good so um anyway that's it so uh, aside from that Thanks to everybody here in the live stream as well. Thank you guys that have come in and made 10,000 subscribers possible. I mean, I'm like, I'm, I'm belated. I'm just, I'm almost giddy uh, because I'm, I'm just extremely excited. It's all, it's a big, um, it's a big step. We've had a lot of really hard times with YouTube, but YouTube is hard. Uh, you can't let YouTube be personal, although I do let it be personal. Um, it's always nice to see people come in, but it's hard to see people leave and it's hard people see go elsewhere and people just get tired and, and do uh, other things. But when other people leave, that does make room for other people to take their place. And there's a really good group of guys here. So I have to tip my hat off to all the new uh, sponsors, all the new subscribers, uh, people that are that are showing up here. The TeamSpeak is still operational. We got some really, really, really cool stuff here that I'm going to be rolling out. Hopefully, I mean, I say in the week or next, whenever ATS starts slowing down just a hair or finally we finally really catch our groove with it, uh, we've got Farm Sim coming in and it's going to be so freaking good it's going to be good because we're going to have server space we're going to have team speak sponsored up by Nitrado, which is going to be absolutely amazing i'm so excited to see all that happen so you'll be able to game with the people you'll see in live streams and also record it as well as just be able to game yourself and be able to game on an ftg map uh, that we'll be able to put up there. It's, so it's really going to be cool. I'm really looking forward to that kind of thing. Uh, but I know this is all ATS, but I just say all that stuff just to say a special thanks to all the new guys that have come in and made the presence known here in live streams and live chat. Uh, just being here every single night and being supportive of the channel. So like I said earlier, Super Chats, all that stuff is really good. But if you can't afford that and the money's tight, then go watch some videos. Go put watch some time, watch time on some videos and just leave it off in the background. Just be like, you know, just put it out there and just be like, yeah, we'll give me some watch time here. We'll watch this video all the way through and uh, help him out there. Likes on videos, man. YouTube, that I know every YouTube asks you, hey, hit like and subscribe. Well, guess what? That's because YouTube wants to see what people are liking. And if you guys like these videos, and you go look at the the 389 special transport mod the thing's got like 500 some odd likes for it there's a reason why it's got like 30 some thousand views on it. it's because it's got 500 some odd likes go look at all my other videos and be like 60 be like 90 man it might be like 100 here or there but the ones that have a lot of likes are the ones that do very well so keep that stuff up man it's really good uh and tanner i do not know when oregon's coming out uh, hopefully soon bro uh the 131 was good um, so hopefully we're going to, you know, have a little bit more uh, coming out as well with Oregon. Uh, but you'll be able to find Oregon stuff here as well. So Demon Child, yeah, man. I know, man. I know that it's been a while, man. It's like Gold Rush, dude. It's like it just came out. It's like, poof. Then here we go, man. So, so yes. Uh, so just a couple of things. Mod list. So now that 1.31 is up, 
Uh, I'm going to start working on just my must haves and they're not going to be everything that I run, uh, but it's going to be my must haves and I'll have links on it. It's going to make a Google file that you guys can access. Um, and you won't be able to edit it, but you'll be able to access that Google file list. You'll be able to find some of my best mods. Um, and hopefully I can keep that updated, but I will do my best. But now that one three one's updated, we'll see what trucks and we'll see what stuff uh, gets updated here in the very near future. And then we'll be able to roll with that. So just kind of be on the lookout for that. I'm not a full-time YouTuber, so I'm doing this. I'm raising two kids. Uh, I've got a job and other things that are going on. So this is totally just on my second, uh, you know, back half here. So uh, my late night stuff. So, so bear with me on that. I really do have great ideas, but it, it does sometimes take some time to get them all implemented and get them out there. So I appreciate you guys patience on that. Um, so, yeah, <laughs> if we go to dress by late delivery, no, man. <laughs> but it's got that lifted up on stream long enough, didn't I? So, uh, so anyway, guys, so thanks uh, again, especially there uh, for our big 10K. That's a that's a big, huge milestone. So big, big thanks to that. Don't forget to follow me there on Twitter at Full Tilt if you want to kind of uh, be able to keep up with me there. Uh, it's probably a little better than, say, Facebook because I don't really do much Facebook anymore, not on the, the, the actual page there. Uh, feel free to like it at some point if we do get a likes and, and we have a lot of action uh, and a lot of uh, traffic to it, then yeah, so maybe. Uh, the other thing is, the only last thing I want to say is just go ahead and, and make sure as well that this next coming week here, as we do live streams for different stuff or whether ATS, whatever we're playing, make sure you come in and vote. Even if you don't want to see ATS, come in and vote because I'm going to have some links set up for some strong polls that I want to do to kind of figure out what kind of merchandise you guys want. I'm going to do this all in-house, so we'll be shipping everything out. Uh, so it's not going to be going through Teespring or some of these other kind of like cheap knockoff sites where they really get you on the money and the shipping. And then I get absolutely nothing for it. So I'll be able to give stuff away when I want to give it away. I'm just a random, Hey, let's give a shirt away. What size you want? Let's do it. And then there you go. And there's your shirt. So this is things that I'll be able to do that other people won't. So I'm going to start working on some designs for some different things, but I want your guys input on that. And it's important to me to get you guys input. So if you're here, if you're there, go ahead and make sure that you let me know what it is ever that I'm asking you to kind of go through. It might be like a little survey uh, that we can kind of get fit up. Where are your hats? What kind of hat? Do you want the buckles in the back? Do you want the snapbacks? Or do you want the fit one fits all? Or you want the stretch fit, flex fit? I mean, like that kind of stuff, you know? So if we do this, I want to do it right. I want to do it uh, with you guys in mind since you all be the ones that maybe potentially want to buy this. And other small stuff, stickers, decals, what size, how big, what, you know, what do you want it referenced at? I mean, just stuff like that. So anyway, just keep that on your radar. I really Really hope we can do that this this coming week. Um, and yes, Tanner, that is your conflict on the 389, 370F. I'll answer this question and then I'll go uh, because that one is not up to date on 1.31 yet. Uh, unless you go to an external site and download the fix for the 131, which puts it in the dealer, which is the only way to do that. Uh, you'll have to wait if you want to buy it off the or get rabbit off Steam. So I hope that answers that one as well. And thank you there, Dead, Dead Saints Drummer. So appreciate that subscription as well. Coming in right at the back end of the bell here. So appreciate that, man. Uh, yes, full game on Twitter. Uh, I am. It's at full tilt. F U L L T I L L E D. Uh, and that will uh, that will get you there to me. So Jesus Manuel Tapio, what's up, hola amigo, hola, como estas, bienvenidos, adios, muchacho, we will gotta see you, Leo, good to see you there as well, Evan Jackson, good to see you there, trucking seventy seven coming in right at the bell so thank you there buddy appreciate it guys i will see you all tomorrow night we'll be streaming again we're streaming all this week don't forget the polls don't forget the likes don't forget everything else thank you for 10k we will see you later guys peace thank you there trucking we'll see you guys